How to launch and land your power kite. Hello and welcome to Video Joke, two of the most basic principles you will have to master when power kiting or launching and landing. Here with the help of Traction Kites UK are our top tips to do this correctly. Terms. Leading edge. This is the edge of the kite with the air holes in. Downwind. This is the position your kite needs to be in to initially launch. Step 1. How to grip. When using the twin handles on your kite, you need to make sure you are holding them correctly. Place the line between your fore and middle finger when gripping the handle. Step 2. Launching with a friend. When you're first starting out, it may be easier and safer to take a friend along with you. They can stand downwind from you and hold the kite by both tips at a sideways angle. They should give you a sign when they are letting go and you should pull your handles back slightly to make the kite rise into the air. Don't throw the kite into the air. Make sure they step backwards after launching so they don't get caught by any of the lines as they're gripped by the wind. Step 3. Launching on your own. Set out the kite and make sure that the leading edge is facing upwards. Prop the kite up and grip the handles. By bringing the top of the handles up and back, the kite should take off on its own. Only a small movement is needed to launch the kite. Then bring your hands back down in front of your body into the flying position. Step 4. Launching in high winds. Firstly, you must make sure the conditions are within your skill capabilities. You must always be aware of what is downwind from you. In case you get pulled along by the launch, you don't want to crash into anything or anyone. You may get pulled along, so lean backwards and keep your feet flat so you can slide or scud across the ground. No matter what your ability level, a smaller kite is always safer in high winds. Top tip. You can leave your weights bag on one end of the kite, underneath all of the lines, and then bring the other tip up to launch. The wind will then catch this tip and take the kite up as you bring the handles back. The weight bag will drop off as the kite rises. Step 5. Landing your kite. By bringing the handles forward, this will cause the kite to break and it should dip out of the wind. Make sure you brake with both hands at the same time, otherwise it will cause your kite to spin. Done.